Hello everybody and welcome back to the Expert Influencer Academy tutorial series. I am your host Charles Watson and the founder of Expert Influencer Academy. And here at the Academy we are all about helping you spread your message, grow your business or brand so that you can live a more inspirational, impactful and meaningful life. If this is your first time to our channel, please consider subscribing. So today, guys, I want to share with you another free, powerful, and awesome SEO tool that uh, really deals with keywords and keyword research that you can use and put in your SEO arsenal to help you gain momentum, to help you attract more prospects, turn them into leads, which eventually become customers to help you make more money and grow your brand and this is also a great way to rank in Google as well so the tool that I want to talk to you guys today is called keyword in and you can get there by going to keywordin.com. and when you get there this uh, this is what the site looks like and this is a great tool for you to combine keywords to generate phrases that you can then turn around and put into your articles that you write, your blog posts, your social media posts, and also your YouTube videos and your video marketing strategies um, just kind of behind the scenes and pile those tags up so that you can get exposure and your videos can be found. So I'm going to show you this. It's pretty awesome. I've been playing around with it today and I think you guys are really going to like it. So when you get into keyword in Dot com you're gonna go here to generate keywords for SEO and for PPC and then this is gonna take you to the <clears throat> interface we're just gonna go ahead and clear this out now basically what this tool is is you could put one four keywords here and hit generate and then it's gonna generate key phrases and then I will show you what you can do with those key phrases so earlier in the day I was uh, thinking you know, if you have a cooking channel or if you're into cooking and you just really want to look up the latest, greatest, best, uh, tastiest fried chicken recipe, right? So you have this incredible recipe for fried chicken and you want to produce some content with it. So I'm going to show you how we can start here to help generate ideas for you to build your content. So here in the first box, we're going to put in a couple... Uh, you know a couple examples so we're gonna put in easy tasty best homemade southern and then here in this box we're gonna put fried chicken and then here we're gonna put in recipe Ooh, there we go spell check is your friend um, and then here we could put for family for kids and here we could put re under recipe let's add let's stack some more words here we could put uh meals dinners lunches um things like that all right and then we're going to generate <clears throat> and this is the cool part look at all these generated key phrases right easy fried chicken recipe for family easy fried chicken recipe kids and you could just go down the line here homemade fried chicken meals for kids homemade fried chicken dinners for family you could grab one of these right so you're gonna grab your phrase and then you're gonna come over to Google and you're gonna drop that phrase in there and then there's a couple other tools that I use that you really should be using and one of those is keywords everywhere and if you I will link a video uh, I'll put it up here in a card a link to a card the video we did about keywords everywhere um, and so this is the first tool that you know above, beyond this that you're gonna want to use so you can see that that exact phrase really doesn't get anything. It gets zero searches a month, homemade fried chicken dinners for family. But here, chicken breast recipes gets 450,000 searches a month. So we can go here and we can click on this. And now you can see with keywords everywhere and also with SEO Quake, 
this is another one and I'm, I will do a video covering SEO quick but you can see here the kind of traffic and stuff that's being generated for chicken breast recipes and then what you can do is you take this so you know that there's some traffic here and you know that if you created some content that included the keywords chicken breast recipes that you would get some hits you would drive some traffic to your site so the next thing you want to do is you want to grab this and you want to come over here to Google Ads and use Keyword Planner, right? So Google Keyword Planner. So we're going to drop this phrase into there, chicken breast recipes, and we're going to get results. And what this is going to do is this is going to populate a list of the most popular keywords. And it's going to show you here how many people are searching for this exact phrase a month. So here you have baked chicken breast that could be a video or a content idea baked chicken recipes so you could just uh, change this from chicken breast recipes to baked chicken recipes that gets hundred and ten thousand uh, searches a month and these are real time these are what people are searching for and if you go up here it gives you a really cool graph by month and year and it shows you the keyword volume and not only does it show you the keyword volume, but it also shows you how many individuals searched for that exact term on their mobile device. So you could see here that chicken breast recipes gets a lot of volume. So you could definitely do chicken breast recipes. That's definitely in the ballpark. It gets 450,000 searches a month. Um, and the competition is low so let's take chicken breast recipe so all right so we're, we're developing our our kind of strategy here so now because you're going to produce video content let's say we're going to make a, a YouTube video I can jump over to YouTube and I can type in chicken breast recipes and I can see here again 450,000 searches a month but here using another plugin and I'll link a card up here for vidIQ, make sure you check out that powerful SEO tool. But you can see here that it's 88, uh, the high of 88 out of 100 in search volume, but the competition is 71, and it's kind of almost in the red there. So, so what this is telling me is that I could make this video and I could create content called chicken breast recipes, but it's going to be real hard to land on the first page of YouTube here. So I want to check like the, uh, the recency of these videos. So you got this guy here, uh, Flav City. He's got 433,000 subscribers and he posted this video about four months ago. And this one's called Three Ways to Cook the Juiciest Chicken Breast Ever. This one's 10 Simply Chicken Breast Recipes at Home, How to Cook Chicken. This has 1.1 million views. It was made three months ago. So you have two that are kind of recent, and then you have the very next one is six years and a month. But if you really look at these, none of these videos are called exactly chicken breast recipes. No one has a video called exactly that. So this, even though there is a lot of competition for the topic, as a creator, as an affiliate marketer, someone that wants to monetize this video and sell maybe um, chicken uh, you, you know, like the other things for the meal through at my Amazon associate links, or if I wanted to sell like the chicken pans or the oven mitts or the thermometer, uh, the supporting hardware needed to create this meal, uh, on Amazon through my associate program, I would take a risk and I would make this video called chicken breast recipes. I'd probably add something on it. Uh, at the beginning to make it more user-friendly like easy chicken breast recipes you can see here that only one person easy chicken dinners it's it's not even it our search volume came down a lot but our competition came down too so this probably is a great video idea but I hope that this shows you how you could take a phrase just some random keywords from keyword in on an idea and then you could take that phrase run it through google ads 
And here it gives you other topics. So it, you could do a stuffed chicken breast recipe or a grilled chicken recipe. And then you just plug it in, generate those ideas, come over here, vidIQ will tell you the competition and what your chances exactly of ranking and getting listed. And you can use this to create all kinds of content for your social media pages. Um, this is great. We use these tools on a regular basis and this is how we drive organic traffic to our channels. Uh, you don't have to pay for advertising, although we do because we enjoy the boost. Remember, advertising is like throwing gasoline on the fire. Uh, but it is nice that we can make evergreen videos that work for us 24-7 even while we sleep with our affiliate links and people checking it out and watching our videos and subscribing to our channels and clicking on our Amazon affiliates. So we're making money. 24 hours a day and this is how we do it this is how we generate ideas for content it works for us i know it can work for you guys too so guys keyword in that's keyword in.com i hope you found this video useful if you did please smash that like button give us a thumbs up and please also share this video with someone that you might think could benefit from the information inside Thank you so much for joining us through uh, another tutorial series. I hope you guys are enjoying these. If you are, please leave me some feedback. Check out those other cool tools because you need them all. Uh, we have a Google Ads Planner video. We have a vidIQ video. And we have a Keywords Everywhere video that complements this product. So make sure you check all those out. Arm yourself with the tools you need and go out there and kick some ass. Have a great night and we will see you in the next video.